Hello there, John here, welcome to my channel. If you're a newcomer, welcome. Um, very pleased to have you here. I hope you enjoy my videos and you'll stay around and subscribe um, and enjoy what you you watch them. If you're a regular old timer, welcome back. Um, I just wanted to do a quick um, video to, you know, it's not a scheduled one, this is a completely unscheduled one, I just wanted to add it in um, to, to do a bit of like an update on what's going on. Um, it is quarter past four away in the morning, I have been up all night, but I've been super proactive and super busy, I couldn't sleep because of the weather, um, this time of year get, really gets and affects me. Um, mentally and physically um, so I thought you know I'd stay up and do stuff but I've been really busy um, unpacking raw files of emulator games I've been downloading a ton of emulators um, stuff like Game Gear, Dreamcast, um, Mega Drive, Jaguar um, Sega CD, Sega 32X, Master System, um, SNES, N64, you know, literally a whole range of really old classic stuff. I've still got a bunch of stuff I try and figure out how to use because they're bin and queue files and I'm not sure how they work um, with emulators. Um, so you know, it's I've been really busy with doing that. Um, that's took up most of my night. Um, I've got the Fear Trilogy now um, in the list of my games that I can play. I've never played them before. Never. Um, well, I, I tell a lie, I had Fear 3. I think it's 3. It's either 2 or 3. Um, I played about 10 minutes of it and I couldn't get into it. Basically, I put that down to the fact I haven't played it for number one. So, is that more? I don't know. Um, so, you know, I've got all three of them now. Um, so, I'm going to play them from the start. Um, I'm going to record it. Um, I'm going to put it up when I normally do my Unreal. So, I'm going to like alternate or switch between them. Sometimes it'll be Fear, sometimes it'll be Unreal. Um, basically that will be like a more modern type of thing because obviously I've got my SNES games that I've got in my, my monthly schedule I've got my Genesis games I've got in my monthly schedule um, and the Unreal ones like the PC one um, so that will have like my emulator games that will have um, my more modern games um, and stuff like that. Um, I was a little bit down the other the other day. Um, so I went on GOG, uh, G O T GOG, whatever you call it, dot GOG, GOG dot com, and they've got like a bit of a sale on. Um, so I picked up Doom, um, Ultimate Doom, Final Doom, the Master Levels, um, Doom Two. Um, I picked up another game, just a random game that was on sale that looked, the, the, the thumbnail looked really cool so I thought you know, I'd get that, I've not played that yet. Um, and they threw in a couple of other things like Elder Scroll Arena, like old Elder Scroll Arena type games, um, so I've got those I can play now. Um, I say I've got probably a couple of thousand games now on emulators that I can play. Um, the cool thing about the Game Gear one is it's in a small box on the screen, so when I when I'm filming it, it'll be whatever on the screen will only be a small box. But um, it's actually got like the Game Gear like, outer case, um, and then you got the screen within it. So I thought that was quite a cool little touch. 
Um, what else has been happening in my life? You know, it's been a while since I've done one of these, you know, so I figured I might as well get it done now. Um, I'm still doing my beard club. My schedule is going quite well. I've got the next month's videos pretty much already um, recorded for August. The only ones I've got left to record are my coin collection. I've got this month, say this month's coin collection um, and this month's beard club um, because that doesn't get released until towards the middle of the month. So I won't have that until about uh, like the twelfth or something. Um, and they don't release the the scent um, description until something like the fifteenth or the nineteenth or something. Um, I'm not doing a wish haul this month. There was thirty one days in the month, so technically the last day should be my wish haul. Um, I'm a little bit skint. I've got loads of stuff going on, um, but because I'm a bit skint, I'm doing something a little bit different. I'm not sure whether to do like a little mini wish haul and just get like a few random bits and bobs that are free that are just going to cost like a couple of quid posted and packaged and spend like a tenner. Because um, I've seen bits and bobs on there that I need, like screwdrivers and drill bits and stuff like that. And they're all either free or they only cost a couple of quid and then a couple of quid postage. Um, or I'm going to do, um, I've seen a few people do them on YouTube um, and I looked into it and they, there's quite a large selection of mystery boxes on eBay. Literally just go into eBay in the search box type mystery box or if you want to expand it to certain types of genres. You can like mystery box for men, mystery box for women, mystery box gaming, um, mystery box software. You know you can do that kind of stuff, and they can cost anywhere from a couple of quid up to about fifty quid. So what I might do is I might do a kind of ten fifteen pound mystery box. Um, I get paid on the seventh, I think. Um, so, you know, it'll, if I order it on the 7th or 8th, or that kind of week, then it'll get here with plenty of time for me to record it and upload it and everything for the 31st. Um, Yeah, so that's that. That's that wish haul. That won't be a wish haul, but it might be a wish haul, but it might be an unboxing of a mystery box. I don't know. That that day, it's never fixed in sound that it's going to be a wish haul. I've got things I need to buy from Wish. I found a microphone that I need to buy from Wish. Um, because obviously at the moment I'm only using my camera microphone, which apparently isn't the best. It does distort the sound a little bit. Um... I've had a few bit of, a bit of feedback on it um, to let me know that my my sound isn't the best. So now I'm gonna get like a better camera, but I don't know where it's gonna fit on this desk because there's a load of stuff going on. Um, I've had to get an old mouse out because my gaming mouse broke. The laser tracker on it was kind of uncalibrated and I don't know how to recalibrate it um, so that was kind of moving even though I wasn't touching the mouse it was just moving across the screen on its own so I had to get an old mouse out and it is horrible it is just a bog standard generic um, kind of mouse and I don't like it so I've got to get a new mouse my keyboard, if you look at my keyboard, if it will let me, and you look at all those missing characters, that's fine. All those, so that shows how much I use the keyboard. So I need to get a new keyboard. 
Um, I'm going to buy them from Wish. So there will be a Wish Hall, and the Wish Hall will be kind of probably about a hundred pound. Where I'll just buy loads of stuff for my PC, and it will be connected to my vlogging and everything. Um, I have just stated in a, uh, a previous video um, that's going to go up towards the end of the month um, that I'm tempted to get a Patreon sorted out. Um, I don't make any money out of YouTube. Um, they've done it so the small guys don't really make any money unless you've you've got a good 30, 40,000 subscribers, you don't make money from YouTube anymore, um, which is a little bit annoying. Um, you know, I've only got like 35 subscribers. I wish it was a bit bigger. I don't want to be a beer tube or Dancy Bearded or PewDiePie or anything like that. I don't want to be that big. I just want to be, I don't really want to be big or even reasonably big. I just want to have a nice community. Um, not that people not that people comment on my videos anymore, um, which is a little bit annoying because it means I don't know if I'm doing good or bad. Um, you know, it's. I wish people would leave a comment, even if it's just like, "Hey, you really suck," or "Hey, good job, keep it up." You know, just something. It doesn't have to kind of spark a conversation. Um, and I'm getting some views. What I've realised, I've been looking through my um, video album um, from when I started. My first video got 48 views. Um, up until about three, three or four years ago, I was constantly getting between... 20, 50, 60, 80, 100 views on my videos. People were commenting on my videos. Um, and then I went away for a year um, for reasons I can't really face going into. Um, those that know, know. Those that don't know, don't need to know. Um, basically, it was to do with my mental health. I went a bit whappy. Yes, yeah, so I took a, a year out, and then, also I went away for a year, and then I took a year out. So two years I was gone, and in those two years, um, since I've been back, my videos have only been getting three, four views, um, sometimes maybe 20, 30, um, but they haven't been like it used to be. Whether that's because people aren't using YouTube anymore and they're now doing Twitch and streaming and stuff like that now, I don't know. Whether it's a sign of the times, whether people moving away from YouTube, I don't know. Um, whether my content isn't as good as what it was anymore, I don't know. Um, I've got some videos that have done really well. I've done the, the Moose. Clear score um, Moose TV adverts, they've done really well. One of those videos has actually doubled my viewing figures alone. Um, one video's done about 150, another one's done about 300, and then video number two, um, for some reason, has pretty much gone viral. Not obviously several dozen thousands um for me it's gone viral anyway there's it's like five and a half thousand um and when you've only got an overall total of eight and a half thousand views for all your videos you know, it just shows how big that one video was um so you know, I need to try and... I've been looking back to see what, what popular... What videos were popular. Um, and it looks like my Batmobile videos did really well. They were scoring a couple of hundred views. 
Um, so I need to get into the spare room and take photos of all my Batmobiles um, and put those up to finish off the collection because I never finished it because I went away. Um, my dedication videos seem to do quite well. So I need to do more of them. I need to find more things I can dedicate and do stuff for. Um, either a person or a website or something. Um, my product testing video seems to do quite well and my unboxing video seems to do quite well my wish hauls and other unboxings they seem to do quite well you know, so I've got things that do okay so I need to try and do more of those and pay more attention to those and so on um, but as I say I'm thinking I've gone off piste there I'm thinking about doing a Patreon um, because I don't get any money from from YouTube as I say because they do they don't do small people now um, I'm only on benefits um, so you know if I opened up a Patreon I don't know if people would join it or anything even if it's just like one, two quid um, a month, maybe five a month, if I get like half a dozen people doing that, um, then yeah, that would be kind of cool, because that way I could pay for my beard care club bombs, it would pay for my wish holes, it would pay for the equipment that I need to improve, you know, at the moment I'm trying to get the Logitech C922, the one with the green screen, because this isn't exactly appealing. Um, so if I can, I'm going to try and get a green screen going on. Um, I've got loads of people just saying me just to get a green screen. But then I've got to set it up here. Um, and obviously, because this is area gets used quite a bit, um, I'd have to put it up, take it down, put it up, take it down, and like, well, at least if I get the camera, um, the C C922, that does automatic background replacement. You know, so I don't have to have a green screen; it does it automatically through the software. Um, so if I can do that, it'll look a little bit better for when I'm playing games or when I'm doing dedication videos on a website or something. Or just this, just doing this, I could black out this and have something, maybe have that, that there, but bigger, um, I'm not sure, I just want my video to look a little bit more professional to try and get more people to think that I'm not just some nut job, I mean I am a nut job. But you know, I don't want people to think that I'm just some kind of amateur. You know, I've been doing this for five years now. You know, so it's not uh, something I've only been doing for a few months. I'm still learning. Um, only the other day, um, for the 31st of July's video. I learnt how to edit in text into a video. I didn't know how to do that before. You know, so I'm still learning. I want to try and learn how to edit out all my ums and ers and oohs. Um, you know, so it'll look like I'm jumping all over the screen um, rather than having ums and ers and just one continuous video we have woken up um, yeah so as I say Patreon possibly um, I don't know how I could hear that whether I was to introduce um, how Jake Monroe does it and how it's like a basic one one dollar tier where you just get your name as a thank you at the end 
at the video for each month or then have like a higher tier for something else um, but obviously because I don't do anything else I can't really offer anything uh, I've got no t-shirts I've got no special videos um, so I don't know how to how to do it and whether I just have that one tier of just one 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 or two dollars per video with the option for people to limit how much they wanted to pay I don't know um, it's something I'm looking into I don't know the legal side of it yet um, obviously because that would then be an income but I'd still be able to um, get more benefits I don't know um, it's all complicated now I want to want to do YouTube more now, I enjoy doing it um, but it's it's not easy when things don't come naturally um, things aren't flowing as well as what I would like it to flow um, so I don't know um, anyway I'm starting to ramble again that's really all I want to say, just a, a quick kind of update on what's going on in my life. It is starting to get reasonably light outside. It is now 25 to um, 25 to 5. I've been going for 20 minutes or right, well, over 20 minutes. Um, so, um, yeah. I'm chilled. <laughs> uh, yeah, I want to do stuff, but it's case to case of being able to afford it, unfortunately. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna leave it here. Um, I would really appreciate it if you did leave a comment, um, even if it's just to say that I'm really crap and I'm boring. Um, you hate my guts, um, whatever. Um, but of course, by doing that, you're going to interact with me, and therefore, you're going to see more of my feed. So, maybe that's why people aren't commenting because they don't want to see more of my feed. <laughs> um, I don't know. Um, so, I say comment if you want to, would appreciate it. Um, like the video again, I would appreciate it. No one's liked one of my videos in a very very long time um, and if you want to you may subscribe I do do all sorts of videos you know I hope there's bound to be something on here that I do that you would really enjoy um, whether it be new games old or new-ish well, last few years um, whether it be old retro games from the 80s and 90s whether it be product testing, whether it be me doing completely stupid things by eating really hot chilli stuff, um, whether it's a tag question so you can learn about me, whether it's an unboxing, um, all sorts. Um, so, you know, do all that sort of stuff, you know. I'd really appreciate it.